in the rule set, you aren't allowed to disagree to go to a uh, Omega or Battlefield form of another stage so long as it's legal. Oh, so Inkling, Inkling from Street Shark. I Okay, so I always say Inkling is the love child of Sonic and Diddy Kong, which please do not send me fan art of. I'm sure it exists. Uh, but uh, their movesets are very uh, reminiscent of the two characters put together. Uh, R, no! <laughs> uh, uh, that's like some stuff you see on DeviantArt. Uh, Bro, gross. I haven't even heard anyone mention DeviantArt on it yet. Anyways, Ooh, that's gross. but yeah, so I, what my, I was saying from a commentary perspective <laughs> is that the character is very reminiscent of Ariel's, much like Diddy Kong. Uh, the special in Roller is somewhat reminiscent of Spin Dash. It's got a hoo-ha. Oh, yeah. It okay, has a hoo-ha. The Uppy is very difficult to uh, deal with. Also, he's definitely playing a uh, top two Inkling color. I like that one. I like Coffee Shop Inkling. Got to roll with the purple one. Purple one's cool. I, mean, everyone, really good knows that. I, gotta, I gotta go with the Cosmos, but Cosmos is now a corn main, so I can't really <laughs> talk about him in that area. And right now, starting off on Battlefield, and he, if you don't know him right now, he's been making some big moves recently in the local scene. Yeah, he was on at least one of the initial power rankings for SoCal. I'm not sure if he was on two, uh, but he's always kind of at least been in our discussion. And it's really good to see about snakes, uh, especially here in SoCal. They all vary in different play styles. Like, he will be a little more patient with his moves and offs to go for these really good tech chases, while that one guy offs to really just wallow with explosives. Like, his C4 will not be hidden unless he chooses a stage where he can really do that. But here comes Nikita, and let me tell you, Nikita is like the one reason why he invalidates so many recoveries. Yeah. I feel like we see Key using a lot of A buttons uh, in general, uh, using things like the down air, the up tilt we saw earlier. The F tilts especially are kind of Key's calling card. Mm -hmm. And it's also his good movement, like he's trying to recover, like the B reversals on his nades, and he's trying to mix it up, just gets away with it. That was a really to get good the... recovery from Street Shark. Mm -hmm. He's able to like slowly time it out, and the grenade coming down, unfortunately. Well, <laughs> thankfully, I should say, doesn't hit him out, and Key just opting, he's going to use Nikita. Once more, I was actually opting to set a ledge trap, seeing that Street Shark is getting it down, but that should be a forward oh. throw. Oh! 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 Oh, good. Just toss him. Oh. Like salad, my goodness. Shark. Oh, no. He's getting out of there and trying to do the best as he can. Hits him up the fair and. Ah, oh, he's in so he's in a little bit of trouble right now, because when Snake starts racking up the damage, what just happened? <laughs> <laughs> I, Street Shark looking for the down air, but a good recovery from Key is able to actually get the hit of Cypher and follow it up with a down air. Oh, there's one thing that I remember from Key. He's so good from getting the grenade conversions into aerials. He consistently gets the grenade into an up air and all these great things that he's supposed to do. But Shark having a hard time right now, and Key even pushing up the shield, forcing the roll away. He even went for the stick attempt, and thankfully he uses the backer, and he gets him with the roller. That should be a go. Right, but even then, Key got a lot of credit on that stock down throw. Looks good. Good discipline. Oh good my god, discipline. he covered so many options. The F was so fast. Good discipline from Shark. A lot of players will opt to panic, roll towards the stage, but this time he opts to go right back into the corner, knowing that's exactly what Key wants. He stayed in the corner. Great spot dodge to avoid it. And he reads the fact that he's going to do a get up attack. He's inked up quite a lot. He's even the game so fast. Yeah, and that's Inkling's kind of defining mechanic in this game for sure is how much damage he can rack up so quickly but a nice nice little bait jumps away says come on just try and chase me mm -hmm. and great grenade hurting himself that situation shark thankfully didn't hit him with that up there on the grenade of course that would have hit him for quite a bit of damage great movement from key even going for the spike yeah, attempt I, he's all over the place right now mm -hmm. uh, he looks so funky too when he's jumping with the grenade like how he still keeps the same pose oh shark at a Huge position. He's even cornered still, and keep running away with the grenade, knowing not to go for the two times with the F. So it's like the dancing blade thing, where they do the one-two yeah. hits, and you got to see what they'll do in that area. And Key staying alive at 152. Snake with rage. Oh, he missed it. He got the sour spot. The sour spot is not enough to break through, uh, or to break cipher, cipher. itself. Mm -hmm. Probably would have broke Snake out of the cipher, but he missed. Yeah, unfortunately for him, it does miss out on that one. Here comes the who hot for 20% damage and, oh goodness, Street Shark popping off right now. No, goes for the up air instead of the nair. I feel like he's gonna convert it into some extra damage. And he reads the roll, great conversion from Key. Has the grenade on there, here comes the ledge trap. That Shark's gotta be careful for. Thankfully runs right over it and uses the nair on that shield safely to avoid the grenade. Doesn't get the up smash in time, tries to read it, but the up oh tilt God. to the boot. 
my goodness. Das Boot right there. Das gonna Boot. be able to just steal that stock away. Every time he got a sizable lead, Street Truck all of a sudden had momentum for some reason. Yeah, right? Like, remember, he, he was, like, down, like, 0 to, like, 100 and, like, 20, and then stacked up to 105 yeah. with all that in. And Inkling definitely, like, a really well-made character in this game. Like, you know what Inkling's gonna do. Yeah. But out Inkling can outplay you while doing that. Like, if you've seen Cosmos as Inkling, if you've seen um, uh, Armado too. Space. Mm -hmm. And Space, my Space, my goodness, Space. If you haven't been watching European Smash, you're definitely missing out some great players. There's got good space. players over there. Yeah. And there's the Sonic from Street Shark. Mm -hmm. I mean, definitely we'll be able to close the distance a little more, but let me tell you, Sonic's up air is as inconsistent as canine in pools. Oh. <laughs> All right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, you can't say hey, that. He just lost game. He lost game one, man. Oh, I can God. say whatever I want. And uh, Sonic really struggling in this matchup right now, and he's able to get a little bit of damage done. He's actually. Managed to pin Key down in this scenario, but this battlefield is providing Key with a lot of much needed pressure that he's really struggling to find himself out of there. Uh, K9, if you're here, I'm really sorry. Please don't hit me. Uh, <laughs> Jesus, change the subject. Uh, oh, he's chasing key, him. Oh, he caught him with the Nair Key, with the Nikita as well. Chasing him down it all back. Oh, goodness. Street Jerk's taking it back once again. Like, this is what we see. Like, he gets hit up. And he's like, oh, downloading what he's going to do. And then finally gets it down. That C4 barely missed him as well. But Street Shark doing such a good job pinning him into the corner, opting to just walk there. Oh, goodness. Covers the roll lead with the forward tilt. Mm -hmm. What? What just happened? Well, he is here comes Nikita. Here comes again. Ooh, he's alive. Oh, he doesn't get the F tool. Yeah, I was surprised. Sonic may be just pancaking a little bit too hard. Pancake? Ugh, he's dead for sure. That is a cooked pancake. But Street Shark doing so well right now, and hopefully he's able to continue it. And remember, Sonic, what his strength is, his, his F smash is ridiculously good. Oh, yeah. The Looney Tune punch right there. There's so many. Oh, my God. It's like 4th of July the amount of explosions we're seeing. Yeah, you know, it's a very different situation from game one where we... You know, saw lots of a bind combat from Snake, uh, just running in, down airing him, stepping on him, and uh, kicking him look in at the that face. Wall. Yeah, look at that wall. He does a grenade, uh, jumps backwards, uses another grenade that uses up smash and explosions all around. It's covering him, but Street Shark actually getting him and knows that he gets a little too greedy on those attempts. <coughs> wow, that's a, that's a pretty impressive from Street Shark able to get that movement down and ops to jump right ahead and he he knows that he has to do for this more special attack because it's Sonic. He will get it in his face and he yeah. won't beat him out with just straight up attacks. Oh, oh he stuck him! Oh my goodness. Faintly stays alive and Street Shark in a very safe in a very dangerous situation I would say. 108% and jumps right into the C4. I feel like he's <coughs> not playing the same game as Street Shark. Like he's just kind of doing his thing and Street Shark's trying to stop it, and Key's like, oh, you took some damage, maybe I'll do this other thing now, but like, he's kind of just playing his own game and Street Shark's trying to keep up. It's a single player game. Yeah. But like, it looks like a fun one. Mm -hmm. It's like gaming watch. You game, I watch. That's how it okay, works. Okay, Fabs. Yeah, and that, that's exactly how it works, and he's doing such a good job, and Key, setting up this wall of projectiles, this wall of explosives, like anytime Street Shark even just gets a smidge amount of damage, instantly takes a bunch of percent. Oh. No way. Oh! Oh, the grenade pull up there just to be safe. Mm -hmm. When did he drop the C4 there? Mid air. I know, but like, he's, he's getting Oh, he's really good. And hopefully Street Shark doesn't overcommit on that C4, because he's dangerously getting there, and he's right on top of the C4, but thankfully gets away from that situation. How many C4s is he dropping? My goodness. Dude, he's making it rain with them. Oh, he died to the grenade. Ah, uh, he knew it. And here comes Street Shark. Hopefully he gets to something with his lead, but a missed grab attempt. Great get up attack, but it's like, it's horrible because you're like, I have to bite the bullet. Like, you know you're going to yeah. take damage, but you got to get key off of you. Grenade damage. Oh, there we go. But he's actually evening up the score. That's the streets. Yo. Oh, he dash attack. Yo. Yo, he hit the up smash too. He hit the up smash instead of flying upwards. Key. He was looking kind of nice, but Street Truck really kept that oh, a lot yeah. more competitive than it seemed. Mm -hmm. Like, that was a 2-2.